Chapter 21 of The Mandalorian, The Pirate, continues to flesh out the galaxy of the New Republic in very exciting ways. Previous seasons told great stories, but the overarching arc of the season left a bit to be desired, so it's nice to see that this season is building a linear story from start to finish. We're back on Navarro as Grief Karga is working with the engineers to better serve their city, and it really feels like he's become a leader, and not just the guy at the top. Unfortunately, the Pirate King, Gorian Shard, comes back for revenge on his slain pirates, leaving Grief to seek help from the New Republic. Captain Tiva, who we've seen Din interact with last season, gets the distress call from Grief, and it's up to him to call in the cavalry. Here we get a fun cameo by Zeb Aurelios from Rebels, voiced by the legendary Steve Bloom. Captain Tiva is denied help in a cameo from Tim Meadows, and it's interesting to see how the New Republic is fumbling repeatedly, as it makes their eventual downfall feel more plausible. After the Mandalorians are aware of the situation on Navarro, Din requests the clan go to their aid, as Grief offered him a plot of land that could make for a new home. As Vizsla recalls how their people were left to live in the sewers of Navarro, and how he wants a different life for the young of their clan, being a father has really given Paz some interesting growth. The action sequence on Navarro is a lot of fun, and we get more cool air combat with both Din's N1 and Bo-Katan's Gauntlet. After the pirates are taken down and Grief fulfills his promise to the Mandalorians, the Armorer and Bo-Katan have an interesting conversation in secret. The Armorer believes they are in a new age of Mandalore, as her belief in Bo seeing the mythos or feels concrete. She allows Bo to remove her helmet as she walks within two different worlds. She sends Bo off to gather more Mandalorians. Navarro is a temporary home, but soon they will retake Mandalore. What did you think of the pirate? Let me know in the comments, and as always, I've been Barista Bran, and may the Force be with you.